those energy efficiency dollars are the hardest working dollars in American politics. You know, the solar stuff is sexy, nice, or whatever. The, 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 it's the energy efficiency dollar. Just to give you an example, you, you take one energy efficiency dollar. Somebody's sitting here, they're, they're, they're unemployed, they've got the skills, they could be working, maybe they're in construction, maybe, you know, they're, they're something else. But they're, they're idle. With the energy efficiency program, you take that one dollar, you give it to them as, as wages. That one dollar just cut unemployment. Now she stands up, walks across the street, and now she's gonna retrofit grandma's house. She's gonna blow in clean insulation, she's gonna replace windows and doors, she's gonna put in uh, new Ford furnaces and boilers, she's gonna do all that work. Well, guess what? That's stimulating the economy, but it also, that same dollar that cut unemployment just now cut grandma's energy bill. Okay? That, that dollar's not finished. Most places, you guys got a lot of hydro, but most, most places, you got some dirty, coal-fired power plant someplace that's spewing out a whole bunch of crap causing asthma and everything else to people who live near here. Why? Because grandmama's house and every other house is 30%, 40% inefficient. Well, that same dollar that just cut unemployment now just cut grandmama's energy bill by 30%, just cut pollution by 30%, which means it just cut asthma by 